Hi friends, let's just lay down a loop track today. Uh, right, so I'm gonna play off of E minor, then C over G, D over A, and E minor over B. So, spell those out. You got a regular campfire E minor chord, open two, two. I'm only playing the lowest three strings. Then the C over G is gonna be three, three, two. D over A is gonna be five, five, four. E minor over B is gonna be seven, seven, five. All right, and rhythmically, I'm gone. Sort of a John Mayer type thing where you've got thumb, fingers pick, do a percussion thing. So one and two and three and four and one and two. One and two. So just trying to keep that groove going. So now I'm thinking chord tones, E minor chord, open, three and five. C chord tones, one, five and three, eight and eight, 13 and 12. D chord tones. That'll only sound good over the over that chord, but now I'm gonna start combining those E minor chords, C chord tones, D chord tones, E minor chord tones, E minor chord tones, C chord tones, D chord tones, E minor chord tones. So let me spell those out. You got E minor, open, open, C, one and zero, D, three and two. E minor, five and three. C is five and three as well. All right, uh, sorry, E minor. Let me start again here, E minor. C is the same notes. D, E minor, E minor, C, D, E minor. Your E minor and G major scales work everywhere too, so you can do these kind of thirds. So E minor is the relative minor of G major. So you can use a G major scale anywhere.
All your open strings, your harmonics work really nicely over this. Yeah. So all of your open strings work. And this is just all staying diatonic all in the key. You could also go outside of the key, play E Phrygian. So have some fun. I'm going to let that loop for a, mi a minute here and uh, just practice playing over that. See what you come up with. And you can always record this and loop it yourself. And uh, you got a nice little practice track to play over. Just E minor, C, D, E minor. All right. Thanks a lot. I'll see you next time.